A pleasant day to everyone. I am Diana Rose C. Clidoro and my co-author Julian S. Sidokon. We are from Halayhai Elementary School and we are here to present to you our study entitled Home Learning Difficulties Basis for Support Program of Kindergarten. There is a misconception that kindergarten is just about learning the basic skills. But what they don't know, it is more than that. In fact, it is the crucial stage. Everything that a child needs begins at this stage. So it is a must that we teachers maximize the learner's potentials. Let us eradicate this kind of thinking. As presented to our slide, here are the literature and studies that supports and shows the parental involvement during COVID-19 pandemic. This study aims to determine the answer to the following questions. What is the perception of parents and the school closures during the COVID-19 pandemic? What are the difficulties encountered by the kindergarten home learning facilitators? And based on the result of the findings, what do the researchers recommend? This study is a descriptive qualitative design. The open-ended questionnaire developed by the researchers was validated by the master teachers. The researchers used a purposive sampling technique and the responses were analyzed using the thematic analysis methodologies. This table shows how home facilitators feel about the decision to close the schools. After the survey conducted, here are the list of the difficulties encountered by the home learning facilitators in kindergarten. Lack of education, time management, lack of motivation, and some claims that they have no difficulty encountered. Short attention span got the highest percentage among the reported difficulties of home learning facilitators. It is 36.9%. And 4.8% is the lowest percentage that falls under the parents that claims they don't have any difficulties encountered being a home learning facilitator. It implies that short attention span is the most commonly reported difficulty of a kindergarten home learning facilitators. Naturally, children have short attention span and parents' attitude towards this affects the teaching learning process. Therefore, no matter how creative and interactive the learning activities are, the success of learning still lies primarily on how home facilitators execute the task. This study suggests for a basic training program for the home facilitators and an orientation on the different teaching strategies that will greatly help in maintaining the attention of the learners. These programs are to be implemented in the future. As presented in our slide, here are the references used in conducting our study.